Hello friends, welcome back. So now we will take this UI and create a PY file. This UI file is exist in our video player. Okay, uh, in my desktop I created a video player and inside that I created a UI folder and inside UI folder I just copy this. And you can see that our icons.qrc file also exists here. Now our, our goal is to actually create this UI, convert the UI file to PY and QRC file also to PY file. This time we are using PYQT4. So because in my previous video, I showed you how you can do it with the Pi side. So now this is the example for PYQT4. Let's just take copy the path of PYQT because all we need to uh, we need is PYRCC for icon compilation and PYUIC4 for UI, UI compilation. So let's just open command window here. Put this and let's just copy. Okay, then main dot ui main dot py all right so we done so with that we just converted the ui file to py now let's do with our icon qrc so for that PYRCC icons icons underscore RC dot PY. Okay, so we just created our two two files and now let's open our PyCharm so in PyCharm I can see I have a main PY file which is our interface we just created now let's just create our main file which will start our player so I will rename this as my video player Okay, so let's start importing some important library first from from PYQT4 import QT GUI from PYQT4 import our player library which is for non library. Okay, let's also import from UI import main so this is our UI interface which is we created now let's create a class quickly for that video so video player class and in that the first argument will be our main dot ui main window because we created a main window there and for now second argument will be we need to call qtgui dot q main window now let's just create a init function there with super video player class so and in it setup.py itself create it under so now uh, we need to create a main function which is uh,
then create app equals to qtgui dot q application now kill call a video player there and video player is our video player class and video player dot show show not not show maximize just show and then app dot execute okay showing something let's just run this for now okay so now we are able to see our user interface inside python so next video we will start adding functions for these buttons and also we will add a file browser to open file and select the video and load the video inside our player so i will see you in the next video